do what I'm doing. Yes? May I help you? Huh? Lloyd, huh? Huh? Can I help you? Can I help you? What are you doing this morning? Nothing. He's busy repainting the side. There's something about that. Did she put waterproof paint this up? I saw it with the, the, the water. I need to get two proper barrels put today. That would save the water from going on the siding, right? Two proper barrels for the rainwater going on. You could put a spigot on it and run the hose that way. Even though I want them closer to the thing anyways. But anyways, good morning guys. Happy Sunday. I'm moving my indoor plants out under my gazebo here. So I'm, I took this out. Hopefully they so I think they should be fine because this is where they're going. So they'll get sun, they'll get fresh air, and I think they'll grow some more in the summertime. So I'm about to put them out here. So let me put you guys down. Listen, hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Please forgive me. I do be recording, but it gets busy at the end of the school year and then summer happens and then I forget to post the videos. Forgive me, work with me here. I apologize, I'm, I'm the worst vlogger. I be doing stuff and forget to record. Like the other day, I literally rearranged my whole Ikea um, pack system. I had to take some drawers out and put the extra drawer in, rearrange it, and I forgot to record everything. Honestly, honestly guys. Yeah, I'm terrible at this. <laughs> I try, I do try, but I be forgetting. Like right now, I, did, I took all the, the, the house plants out I was, was about to start rearranging them under this gazebo and I was like crap I need to grab my camera but work with me please I beg you forgive me and oh, uh, I'll give you guys a good update on the guard like literally I'm gonna record this video right now it's gonna be raw on in the comments you know let's talk let's do this um but yeah let's get these house plants out the house and underneath this gazebo for the summer and see how they work I think it'll be good for them I do need to repot most of them but i need to head to home depot for soil for that and i also need to head to home depot for soil for um to hurry up some parts of my garden um but let me get the house plants out here i'll give you guys an update on the garden stuff and then we'll continue from there did i say good morning guys good morning thanks for watching come welcome back uh subscribe again as i said before and let's do this so i'm thinking about putting Oh, you know what? I just remembered the dang scrolls. Oh God, I hate these things. Oh, just remembered about the scrolls, guys. What am I gonna do? I wish I had space down in there to put them. I wish I had space in my actual garden because if you um, hold up, let me. I'll give you the guys the garden update first. Hold on, wait a minute. Let's give you guys the garden update first. Let's let's go to the garden. If you guys remembered, I have I had the um what's it called the potato boxes out here but the, and I had a mesh over it I had chicken wire over it but somehow the squirrels kept getting into it so because of that I had to move them inside um so I had to move the potato boxes inside and this one is a sweet potato I need to get the holes out to water this garden actually I should probably do that before I do anything else the sun's already out um, so yeah I had to move all the potato boxes inside two of them two boxes died off this one I replanted some new potatoes in it yesterday and this one died off as well I also need to head to Home Depot to get more soil to fill this up that one died off so I added new potatoes to this one um, this one as you see this one's doing good I need to add more soil to it this one's also doing okay so I need to add more soil these are um, some lettuce that I had thrown and this one's radishes I need to take some out and transplant uh, this one was some more lettuce I don't think that's lettuce cabbage and stuff this is the, the garlic um, 
Yeah. Didn't work out so well. They died back. I dug up two and it was very small. So I don't know. I don't know. And my biggest problem is this dang tree. So the squirrel goes, they play up there, then they come here, everything falls in here and then this thing starts springing up once it's been raining a lot, so it's everything springing up here. Um, what's supposed to spring up is not. Me kalalu. Kalalu na spring up. Uh, another bag of flowers that I need to plant. Strawberries are doing really well here, I need to pull up the thing. Carrots aren't doing that well over there. The onion's doing something. I don't know if it's, if it's growing. But like I said, my garden is a trial and error garden. I'm not a professional. I am just a hobby farmer. I do it because it, I like it and it takes my mind off of things. And it keeps me busy down here on the days that I'm off or in the evenings when I get off of work. So strawberries are doing good. I did plant some scallions or green onions in with them. Those ones are doing all right too. That one's still empty. My aunt brought me more pepper plants. I don't know where I'm gonna put them. This box look like something's springing up in it, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, the raspberry bush is doing good. Ah, uh, blueberry. I don't know. And I'm gonna need to move them out eventually and make a cage for them separately. Raspberries, those are doing good. I need to go get the the holes. Uh, this bok chow is doing good. Just gonna leave it there some spinach i'm gonna leave it right there i'm not even gonna spread those out i think this is some basil not basil parsley that's doing good the back chow's coming up these pepper plants something's already out here eating so i need to go get some neem oil i need to get some neem so i could do it this tomato i literally transplanted it in here to um to see how it would do and look at it it's literally the one that's doing the best and i just broke it god dang it I literally just broke it look at that I'm gonna have to leave it and see how it works out I'm gonna tie it up right there it has strong oh. anyways so yeah so this is what the transplanted tomatoes are looking like I need to um, get twine and I have all my bamboo sticks and my sticks right here to tie it up more tomatoes are doing good peppers are doing all right it's kind of funny because the tomatoes in the box in the buckets are doing really good <laughs> I planted some cucumbers and beans over here um but yeah so some things are doing good some things are trying to do good these some died off the peppers some are still alive but yeah this is the one sweet pepper plant that survived <laughs> i'm telling you i don't know if it's the uh, two actually here's the second one the second one that's doing all right i need to get more the soil to fill them up but this garden is this, this, this. Uh, hold on guys this the garden this summer this season summer garden backyard garden seasons this year is really working on my last nerve it's making me second guess planting flowers in here next year instead of um food. maybe just tomatoes or cucumbers and that's it because right now it's starting to get on my last nerves and i'm thinking about just only planting flowers and some tomatoes next year honestly it's starting to get on my blasted nerve so hold on let me set you guys down and um bring these 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 things out now now i'm worried now i'm truly worried about them i was gonna bring them here But I'm, I am truly worried about them and the dang squirrels. Oh, I put my book back on. So I have them up there right now. So if you see them, they're all the way. They're up there on the porch. I'm going to use the, this thing to put them on. And then they're up there on the porch that I'm going to take them down.
That's where I'm putting them for now. Hopefully, the squirrels leave me alone. Okay, there's two, three bigger pots that I can't lift. So, there's three bigger pots in the house that I can't lift. Obviously, I have to take this big one down and find a different space for it. Um, we do use a little table during the summertime, so I can't leave it on that. I, um, yeah, I need to run to the supermarket to get some food for dinner. I don't even know what yet but yeah let me get the hose out to water the garden first and then I run to or maybe I should run to the supermarket and come back with the hose let me run to the market the West Indian market to get some um, meats or something for dinner maybe some goat piece of chicken yeah this here I don't know how long I'm keep this hair in because it's um it's hot i might need to take this hair out it's only been in it what two weeks because i got it done for graduation but oh it's one thing about me in the summertime when it gets hot i have to wash my hair very often because i sweat in my head so uh we'll see well for the time being guys um i'll come back to you guys in a, in a few i have to run to the store i think i was gonna walk but i think i might drive uh, my cycle just started and I have terrible cramps. I don't know where this came from 20 years no cramps and then all of a sudden I think it has to do with my tubal that I did um, That these cramps are terrible, but TMI um, Yeah Listen to the birds There go Lloyd. 
he's painting the side of the um the house. This side, oh, this side. I, th I think we should just cement it all off and be done with it. It'll give it a clean look. I've tried so many different things and just won't work. But yeah, it's either we brick it all up or cement it all off. Okay, so I'm headed to the store. Um, I'm gonna walk, get a morning walk in. So I switched to my phone because I didn't wanna bring my, bring my camera with me to the store because I wouldn't have anywhere to put it anyways because I'm using my mother's little buggy. I'll show you guys in a minute. So yeah, so I'm cutting through the school campus. It used to, this, is the, this used to be a main street, but obviously they cut it off to um, make it into, for the school, so you can't drive through. But sometimes they leave a little side gate open and we could walk through when it's not school session, when school's not in session. So it was open the other day, so hopefully it's still open. But yeah, look at the community garden. I wish I didn't have as much trees blocking my garden. Look at theirs. Theirs have no trees, so they get all the good sun. But yeah, so that's what my garden needs. It needs some sun. It's struggling because it's not getting proper sun because the weather's been on and off. I appreciate the rain. I'm happy for the rain. But it's kind of hindering the garden at the moment. But we still have June, July, and August, so we have hope. We have hope, but yeah. Let me show you guys my mother's little book. Hold on. But this is her little buggy that I'm using to go to the supermarket. But yeah. So I'll call you back. I'll come back to you guys when I get to the thing. So high, so high in love When it's cold, when it's dark When I feel like I'm done Just one look at your face But your smile takes me to where you are I wanna give my love to you Oh, night after night Don't let me go You spin me around I could do this every day Cause I feel so high So high in love When it's cold When it's dark When I feel like I'm done Just wanna look at your face And your smile takes me home Keep it up. 
As you saw, I got some goat meat, some chicken, and a bunch of veggies. I mean, fruits. So, yeah. Now I gotta go water the garden. Because I didn't water it yesterday. I mean, it rained hard like two days ago, so. I didn't need no water. I got enough water from the rain. But now I gotta go water it because it was hot yesterday. It's gonna be hot today. Guess what, guys? I forgot three things at the market. I forgot. Well, I didn't forget the carrot. I forgot one thing technically, but I'm going back for three things now. I forgot the 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 peas, the gungo, the beans for the rice. So I'm going back for that, and I need to get mayonnaise for and carrot to make coleslaw. So okay. So I'm back to going back to the store again. Some childhood favorites. I don't even know what that is. Some childhood favorites and a new favorite. I bought some neem oil spray for my garden. Yeah, and some more flower seed. They said this is the mix for another for Jersey, so hopefully they ain't lied to me. A wildflower seed pack and this one. Ooh, this is for my birthday, guys. My birthday's in four days. For my plants for the bugs, because the bugs are here. That's not true. I just ordered it and it came. I ready. My birthday's in a couple of days, guys. I'm happy. Four days to be exact. Thank you. 